Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to this tutorial. I'm really happy to see you. Today we will learn more about the image library and its new feature from TEPN Animation 12. In the library of TEPN Animation 11, you were able to import from the display of your current frame, the current image of your current layer, or from a file outside TEPN. As you can see, you had also the possibility to use this image as reference from image guideline. You can also use it as source for the texturizer of your CTG layer or as source for some effects in the FX stack. In order to follow this tutorial, you can download via the link in the description the file Ramnacro turn. You can now store the current image or all the image of your custom brushes inside the image library. I just have to click on add custom brush current image and it will save my current frame in the library. Or I can click on all image of the custom brush and in this case I will have to enter the name of the folder which will contain the image of my custom brush. You can now see those image inside the new folder. You will have also the possibility to store all the frames of your selected layer inside the image library. I just have to right click on the selected layer and choose create folder in the image library. Choose the name of my folder and I will have some images inside devoted folder directly inside my image library. This option will be useful for the new feature of TIP and animation 12, the puppet layer. Don't hesitate to follow our dedicated tutorials. One of the best improvements of our new image library is that now you can export it and share it with other TPN projects. You just have to click on the export button in the image library. It will open a window from your OS. You will have to select the location on your computer and save it. The image library will be saved as a TVPN file for TVPaint project library image. Once your image library is exported, you can now import it in another TVPN project. You just have to click on the import button and choose the TVPL file that was previously exported. It will import the image library of your previous project inside the new project even if it doesn't have the same dimensions than your previous project. As you can import an image library in projects you've previously created, you can also assign a TVPL file when you create a new project. You just have to go in File, New Project, set your project as you want, click on Browse, select your TVPL file, open it, and then click on New Project. As you can see, once the project is created, if you open the image library, you will find all the image and folders from the saved TVPL. Hope you had a great time. Subscribe for more. Also, don't forget to check out our social media for more content and tips. Thank you and see ya next time.